Hey, what's up everybody? It's me, Miss Ebony V. Welcome back or to my channel. So today I have another synthetic wig review and this is gonna be a voiceover video. So the wig I'm reviewing today is from Sensational, the What Lace Collection in the style Laisha or Leisha and in the color Balayage Caramel. This is my first time I think trying this color. As you can see, this is a very pretty color. You get some light and dark browns with a dark root and you get a couple streaks of a blondish color as well. So this is the nice hairline that claims to be pre-plucked. Um, it's actually pretty nice. I didn't pluck it at all. Can you believe it? It also has a standard cap construction and it comes with that 13 by 6 free parting space as you see here. So now I'm going to go ahead and install this unit. I can say that when I first put this unit on my head, it does feel pretty spacious. The pre-plucking is only in the middle. As you can see, the sides are not that pre-plucked. So I'm going to go ahead and work in sections, starting with this middle section and just cut that out. I'm going to be using my Even Wonder Lace Adhesive Spray in the red can um, because I'm not really looking for a super hold, even though this is a pretty good hold as well. I also want to mention that I did tint the lace underneath um, using my Maybelline Fit Me powder in the color 360 Mocha. So after melting down the other two sides, I did go ahead and tie it down. Um, for about 10-15 minutes and now I'm just going to show you that this is a versatile unit with the parting options you can wear this as a middle part a left side part or a right side part you can even do a half up half down style which I think would be super cute with the curls that come with this hair but I decided to go with a right side part for today I'm just going to use my wax stick to pretty much mold this part into place and then follow that up with my hot comb. I'm using my Andis hot comb and I usually have it on about five with synthetic hair. Now even though the parting space looks pretty decent, I still went ahead and added some foundation powder to that parting space, but it wasn't absolutely necessary since I tinted the lace underneath. Now let me point out that this is a lot of hair, y'all. Like, they were not sleeping on the density. This is one of those wigs that will keep you warm in the cold. Now oftentimes when using the adhesive spray and tying it down, the hair may get a little stuck, but it's an easy fix with a rat tail comb or an edge brush. Just kind of um, lift the hair from being stuck. All right, so now that I have gotten my face together and I have blended my makeup with the hairline, I feel like it's looking pretty decent. Um, it could have used a little more plucking, but you know, that's neither here nor there. I'm just gonna go ahead and just add one little swoop here on this side as well as the other side. Um, I wasn't gonna add any swoops at all, but I don't know, mood driven and <laughs> I decided to go ahead and add a couple of swoops. Now, I definitely wanted to point out that because this hair is so curly, you're going to get some tangles. Like, we were in Tangleville with this unit. It is very tangly. And it also sheds. I'm just being honest, y'all. It definitely sheds quite a bit. It could be because of the color. I'm not sure, but we are shangling over here with this unit. With that being said, I still cannot argue that this hair is absolutely beautiful. Like you see that little streak, them little streaks going on. It just sets this wig off for me. This little face framing highlights going on up front. I absolutely love this color and style. But as you see, I am trying to comb out some of those tangles because that's what we got. So this is pretty much the final look, you guys. And I, Again, am loving the color and the curls. Yes, ma'am, are you getting a view of this color? I also wanna point out the price range, which is between like 50 and $60. And of course, I will leave a shopping link down in the description box below for you to check out. All right, y'all, so that concludes this video. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and I will catch you all in the next one. Bye, y'all.